Welcome to Scrapbook My Life, where I tell you an embarrassing story to save you from making the same embarrassing mistakes I did. I loved playing volleyball in gym class. I'm tall, so I could spike and serve the ball really well. Once, I heard my crush Cameron say, Sarah's on our team, so we're definitely gonna win. By now, the game had gotten pretty heated. I served the ball and the other team hit it back. It landed out of bounds. It kept rolling and rolling all the way into the boys' locker room. The gym teacher blew her whistle. Sarah, grab the ball, you're the closest. My whole face flushed red. She wanted me to go into the boys' locker room? I whispered, I can't go in there, I'm not a boy. There's no one in there, everyone's on the court. I thought about saying no, but I didn't want to make it a big deal. I have to admit, I was curious. Was the boys' locker room the same as the girls? What color were the lockers? I heard a rumor that there was a hot tub left over in there from the 1950s. Was that true? I walked in. It looked exactly the same as the girls' locker room. And there was no hot tub. But where was the volleyball? I heard something. I jumped into one of the lockers to hide. It smelled disgusting. Someone came out of a stall. It was Cameron, my crush. I tried to remain completely silent, hoping he'd walk out. Then I saw the volleyball. It was under the sink. Cameron saw it too and picked it up. My mind was racing. Oh no, if Cameron brings the ball back to gym class, people will come looking for me and I'll have to hide in this locker for the rest of the school day or maybe even for the rest of my life. I jumped out of the locker and lunged for the volleyball. Ah, what are you doing? Cameron screamed. I'm a girl, I blurted out. I ran back to class with the ball, totally humiliated. Later that afternoon, I saw Cameron walking toward me. Oh no, was he gonna call me a creep? He whispered, let's never talk about what happened today ever again. It turns out he was embarrassed too, because when I was in the locker room, he was pooping. Always trust your gut. If you don't feel comfortable doing something, like going into the boys' locker room, speak up. And don't believe any rumors you hear about ancient hot tubs. They're not real. <laughs>